So I just want to say, first off, like I was saying, thank you for um, doing this. I think it's an important conver- conversation to have. And, I'm, and I think you're, you're the right person to talk to about it. Simply because yes. I feel, and I think you would agree with this premise, that you are, you push the, the, the fair use value, or apparently you don't even care about fair use at all. I, I, and I don't want to put words on your mouth, so you can correct me where I'm wrong. But you seem to not care about it, or at least you push it as far as it can go, so you seem like the right person to talk about it with. Okay, so I think there's three points to that. Uh, I, I don't want to get too debated yet, but basically... Um, I think I value uh, a good life product, right? One, two, um, I'm, I think I'm the right guy because I do a lot of it. I do good reacts, bad reacts, but overall I do a high density of reacts. I do a lot of it. But on top of that, um, uh, against popular belief, I guess these days, I um, ask for permission a lot and I try to make an ecosystem where things are good. And not conflictual. Right. That's the main point. Yeah. Okay. So, okay, that's that's all fair. That's all good. I want to make one, uh, I guess I want to make one thing clear at the top, is that I want to focus on um, the YouTube uploads. Because yeah. the, the Twitch streaming itself, I feel like, is too much of a gray zone, and there's industry standard. I, I would be less, uh, I would be more hesitant to call what happens on Twitch a violation of any kind. So I just want to focus on what you upload to your YouTube channel. Is that okay? Um, okay, so that's gonna be a yes and a no, because I truly believe that a Twitch as a is it somewhat of a competitor on uh, VODs. If Twitch didn't have VODs, then that'd be wrong. Uh, th- th- that'd be right, but Twitch has VODs and all the VODs stay up. But when people react, they leave the VODs up. It's quite the same thing as being able to watch uh, or listen to music uh, on stuff that remains in the VOD. Okay, that's true, but just for the sake of this conversation, I just want to focus on, because l- like from a legal perspective, and I know you don't really care about the legality of it, and that's fine, but I just want to focus on like the YouTube videos as they stand as like a product. I understand that the VODs are on Twitch, and that, that, would, uh, that would you know create an inherent problem as well. But just for the sake of the conversation to keep things clean and uh, keep us from getting too messy, that's, that's my focus, if that's okay with you. Okay. Yeah. Um, you know what? You know what? Okay. Just for the sake of having a good argument, I'll do that. Except for when, um, except for when the topic matters. Sure. Right. It really matters. If, if it is that overall fine, but there are, there are certain points that like it plays a big role <laughs> into it. If it's too big, I think I want to ignore it. But I'll, you I'll, know what? I'll, that, that's a hundred percent fine. I guess I'm just saying that for myself so that when I'm talking, you understand that I'm talking about your YouTube channel and not making general statements about what's happening on Twitch. Okay. That's fair. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. So I guess my first question for you to start is that, do you think your work is transformative? Of course, that's one of the main tenets of fair use. Uh, do you think your work is transformative? Um, yes, you do. Yep. Okay. Wait, wait. Here, I mean, okay, because I, I was watching you yesterday, and here you said it's absolutely not transformative. Here it is. You don't have to care. That's totally fine. But do you agree that uh, you've you've created non-transformative reactions? One hundred percent. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. We're, we've agreed. So here you say you've one hundred percent made non-transformative reactions. Did you change your mind? Um, no, 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 absolutely not. I didn't change my mind. The the whole point is that nevers are really bad because I think we all um, have stuff that is not just one of ever. If you do a, a full on yes or no, I just kind of like play with the question. And that was kind of like. So, but fly. your work is not fully transformative. Some of it is not by your own admission. Uh, yeah. Some of, so some of it is less reactive. Yeah. hundred percent. Okay. So, so in that regard, do you care at all about like IP or copyright? Or like the fact that it's illegal, does that matter? If it, that it might be illegal, uh, does that matter to you? Uh, no. It doesn't matter. Well, if, if flat out doesn't, because... Well, that's fair. That-, that, that's totally fair. And so because it doesn't matter to you, I don't think it's, there's any point to really even discuss well, I can, fair I can use law. Li- I can elaborate a little bit. Um, Go ahead, please. And open the door a tiny bit. Just to give you a, a general angle, um, I... 
I truly believe that usually the people that enforce it are the ones that have a problem with it, right? The, the problem with the nature of the content itself. Um, because uh, in terms of legality, right? Technically, if I'm playing some Telltale game, well, I mean, they could take me down anytime they want, right? Because that's their game and I'm yoinking their stuff, right? So legality-wise, they could clap me for everything I've got, but for just playing their game. Sure, yeah. But obviously, well, so fair use is decided on a case-by-case -case basis by a judge or jury. So it's hard to do big sweeping generalizations about what is and what isn't. But ultimately, if I understand your position, you don't really care about the legality of it. You're more like uh, concerned with the philosophical thoughts of like, of uh, re reacting to content. I, the limitations of that is that I care enough um, enough about it to where it affects me, right? So I have to care because it's, it's the legality of it, right? Like if somebody wants to strike down, wants to uh, send out a claim, whatever, well, I have to act on that, right? So even though I care or not, that, that, will, that will happen. Not right. like, and it, it happens all the time, except I like to create an environment where uh, I engage with people and content that are not going to do that because um, they believe in the mutually beneficial nature of the interaction, such as video games. Even though the video games could um, strike me and that they want for just playing their game on my stream. Right, right, and so, okay. So I think my point is that we can kind of skip this whole conversation and move on to the, because um, I think we both agree, if we did a fair use analysis, and you admit that when you says it's not transformative, that a lot of the stuff you do would would fail the fair use uh, test, so oh, I, we're on and, the same and, page. Yeah, and also a lot of your stuff too. So we're in the same boat, pretty much. Probably not as much. No. Um. So I did a little of the stats. Maybe you don't want to hear it, or because you want to kind of la la la. But um, by density of content, with how much you upload as a person, uh, as a channel, I upload this much, right? Overall, because I have a lot of runtime, you upload about this much. If you were to break down the percentage of non transformative content, your ratio is almost higher as, higher as mine. I, I have I, no idea what you're trying to say right now. You're well, going to have to unpack that more. I don't understand this much that much. You've got to have to explain that a little so, more. So the content you upload on YouTube and on your, on your channels, right? The things that are on YouTube because you don't want to do Twitch. Talk right? about my podcast? doesn't matter. Your content. The stuff that you upload, right? The stuff that you, you control and, upl and upload. Okay. Yes? Okay, sure. So, so overall, if you had every, all the content you put out there, right? I have about that much because it's a lot of runtime. It's a lot. It's a lot. I have of no viewer. fucking idea what you're talking about. Do you have proof of that? Like you're just saying that much, this much. That seems a little silly. I have the one of the highest runtime across the internet in terms of like putting out content. Oh, but fair Literally. use doesn't have to do with how long your stream is. It has to do with your commentary on the video. If Absolutely. your if your stream is 12 hours long and you're reacting to an eight minute video, it doesn't matter. It matters what you said about the eight minute video. It doesn't matter how long you stream for. So I don't understand your point. So if you if you let me elaborate on my point instead of um, bringing the semantics, right? Because you could you could not semantics. Against, That's how fair well, use works. Okay, we're not even talking about the nature of the content yet. Fuck the content. It could be, it could well, be a blank. Hold on, just to be clear, you said you don't do fair use, but I don't also. So we're talking about fair use, just to be clear, right? Okay, okay. Let's um let's reel back a little bit and um stop being stupid for a minute and just kind of like listen. Okay, I'm listening. I, you said um, that I upload non transformative content. Yes, you said that. You said that too, but yes. Yeah, yeah, you know, absolutely, hundred percent. Yeah, and I said that you do too, right? And I'm not saying uh, uh, so. You would say, oh, but if you do, it's like a <laughs> you two double fault fallacy, right? But in the instance where you try to take the high road and say, well, I don't do this, guys. Well, you do. And the re well, my next point is that an amount of content that you upload. You're non-reactive. <laughs> There's actually quite a lot. I don't of it. know what that means. You have to stop saying that. It doesn't mean anything. You're just saying stuff. Well, I'm saying that you're you're just doing this. You do a lot of this and this. I, it, there's no stats. There's no data. I don't even know what you're referring to. Let's I mean, if you want to talk, if you want to talk about stats and data, there's one specific video that I just analyzed. Just picked one out of the lot. A rapper who got a twenty dollar Anne Frank tattoo. When this this Frank is a recent. Let me just read off some stats and you can tell me if mine ma matches up or is worse. So this is a video uploaded to your channel 10 days ago. A rapper who got a 10-minute Anne Frank, uh, sorry, a $20 Anne Frank 
face tattoo, okay? So the original video's runtime is 9 minutes and 13 seconds. Oh, sorry, no. The original video is 8 minutes, 33 seconds, okay? The video here that, yeah. you, up, that you uploaded is 9 minutes, 13 seconds. That means you added 40 seconds to an eight and a half minute video, adding 7.8% runtime. Actually, I even did you a favor. I condensed all of your commentary on this specific video into a vo into just a short video because it's only 40 seconds. So I'll show so, this. Well, this is important because what you say, but, the commentary does matter. Because Before you finish, let, 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 let me go. So you're about to prove me right. I said I do non-transformative dog shit. Yeah. And you're about to show me non just of dog shit. Then. Okay, fair. So I don't uh, have to show it gotcha. to you. I mean, you'll go clap me because, I mean, I what? just said I did that. Okay. That's like, that's like saying um, I'm white and I'm, I'm on camera. Well, you said that like, yours yeah. is more transformative than mine. So I don't understand the consistency or the point well, you're trying to make. Now now that you've brought that up, I mean, sure, let's look at... Um, well, I'm hold on. Before you do that, let's just... Well, I do think it's interesting because the yeah. commentary does matter. Okay, okay, do that then, do that then. What? So then, where? Time, began to notice that Music? Arnold what? didn't have the best. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. He knows as one of the What the, the fuck Ryan am I watching? I mean, if that hey. tattoo was finished. Wait, that actually, the response that, that, that is pretty good, actually. Did what the fuck? That, that guy's really good at that. that. The argument <laughs> <that> every <laughs> year explained the Bro, that crowd, though. Is that Tana? What the fuck? I'm 22. What the fuck? But why do you always speak the dumbest of any comments? I guess. I thought they had like one song. Fair enough. Yeah, that's legit. Shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, anyway, he's like Kappa. He talks normally and shit. Wait. Feel good about themselves. Chat said neutral. So, so that's the that's the entirety of uh the commentary you added to his eight. And and I think it's even fair. And I know you don't you don't defend yourself on this, so I guess it's kind of a moot point. But the the quality of the commentary, like you have to be commenting analyzing, uh, being critical of the content you're watching for it to be fair use, but that doesn't matter, right? Because you don't even believe Ethan, it is. Ethan, Ethan uh, I, 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 think, I think you're right. I think, you, I think you got me. So I think instead, um, I think we should get an example, uh, one, of, one of your examples then. Sure, I'd um, love to. Let's get one of your examples that, that show me the, the guidelines, what I should do to react. Uh, how do I post that in chat? Can I post this right here? Click on that. Um, so instead of having my, having my example of this, I think we should use yours instead, so I could learn how to be a better creator. How about you click on that? Good idea. Play. I'd love to check it out. Oh, I have to open it. Okay, I'll open it. Yeah, it's in the chat. Uh, one second here. Listen to the other so yeah, you uploaded to your XQC Clips channel. You uploaded, uh, uh, five... It, it, you'll see. Dude, you're... It's trend. Are you, so it's you trend uploaded it. five... Well, I just want to explain it. You uploaded five, uh, clips. Or wait, shit, I'm, you upload on this channel so just, fucking just much. Just play it. So when it was my turn, you played my clip. When it's your turn, you don't play the clip and you just comment before seeing it? No, I'm setting it up for you. I'm going to play it. I'm opening it. Here, sorry. So here it is. Here's one of them from your channel. 1.2 million views in six. Now, is it okay if we watch this one? Ethan shows uh, XQC how transformative reactions are done, number four. This is the one you sure. upload. Sure, yeah. number four works. Oh, number one, two, three, or four. Yeah, there's one, two, three, or... four. They're all good. So here it is. So you can exp right. to ours. Okay, King. Jesus. Finally over. Logan Paul. Apollo. Do you notice a problem already, Felix? There's a cut here. Okay, King. Jesus. Why is there a cut there? Huh? Yeah, Just, there's a cut here. So whenever you play my video, did I say, wait, Ethan? I think I think I've seen I've seen something on the screen right there. Is that a dead pixel? Is that, is that a, just play the fucking video, bro? Jesus okay, Christ. Okay, but it undermines your argument if this you're showing an edited clip. If you're cutting out my commentary and then trying to say I don't you do fair use, this seems a little silly. Just, but I'll play it. I'll just play it. Okay. Play the video. Jesus. Finally over. Logan Paul apologized. Coffeezilla, your slang is he is a lopsided journalist with an agenda, more like an internet criminal. Oops, wrong video. That was the first response. He There's actually apologized. Him sitting there like a response. moron. Look at this idiot. Yeah, I mean, it's huh? not. It's not high effort. No, no, no. It's this the is like not that. High effort. I mean, hold on. Here, hold on. Let me get, let me get a not taste of either. Uh, he didn't talk about it. He's literally just sitting there quietly for the first thirty seconds. You should sue him.
Fuck you, XQC, you beef bitch. Turns out it's actually on his secondary second. channel. So she chooses I'll it. play the whole thing. Just let me know when to stop. Single if you comment. want me to. It's entitled, Thank You, statement. Copyzilla. It's the third response. They could sue no you, and they, would, and, and they would be right to sue you, I think. They would be yeah. in the right. I, I think so. Thank you. Paul, and it's a pretty big change in Logan's attitude so far. So let's see what he has to say to us. Coffeezilla is not a criminal. Oh, oh, I wonder really, if that's going to gonna hire me. What? Do you want to keep I, I, up? I'm just, well, I, I was wondering, it's just, the guy says, I wonder what you have to say. I, I wonder what you have to say about this because I'm okay. watching you. You haven't said shit yet. So, I mean, well, I'm just, it, well, you told me to let the clip play. Do you want me oh, to let no, the no. clip play or do you want me to interrupt it? You got to choose a lane. I, I was trying to be, I was trying to be creative with it and kind of do commentary at the same time. And I was trying to last, like, I was asking the old Ethan, the guy that's morally of oh, everybody, okay. high roading, to okay. react to it. But he's not saying shit. So there's like a okay. problem with it. Do you want me to keep playing it or are you playing it? Yeah, you're playing it. Okay. Keep going, keep going. Okay, cool. But in all seriousness, oh. this video. <laughs> that's a good one right there, boy does have some major admissions in it I want to go through. For one, Logan apologizes to me. I called him. I apologized. My, my criticism of him right now is that he uploaded this to YouTube. Because I understand the nature of I mean, live listen, streaming. It goes on. But I, my, I'm going to tell you. I find it really interesting that you think this is compelling. This is actually... Ex uh, first of all, there's so many cuts in it. How, it's not persuasive at all, but one thing I do want to ask you about is why you cut out the beginning of the segment when I talked about it. Here's when I set up the video. Here it is. And again, the framing, what you say in the before and after is really important. So here's how that clip starts, Felix, which you cut out for some reason. Yeah, so Logan made a video after well, he got absolutely bought, like bought deed for his response. Where he's like, I'm going to sue you. This is bullshit. You're why did you cut this? me. Oh, you played a video. An so is audio that, is that, that a pre without is that like, um, Oh, yeah, it's part of the same clip. You just went in here. and took out so, like 30 second slices from it. So basically, what you're saying is that uh, you're going to the bar, right? And this part is like where you get in and you, where you get like a, a beer or something like that, right? And the rest of it, you just huh? fucking say, fucking just. Basically, it's like the intro. So if you put an intro, you're good. Say, like, guys, I have a Dude, video today, do, guys. So and you don't me. understand how fair use works. And, I, and that's fine. But I don't know why you want to debate fair use when you don't care about it. Yes, what you say in the beginning matters, bro. You're, you're analyzing, I'm contextualizing, I'm criticizing, I'm analyzing it. That's what fair use is. I'm transforming it. I'm not just sitting there and the audience isn't just watching the video while, you know, you, you I mean, you do get up and go to the bathroom a lot. Uh, so I know that you want to, so, but, but that's, but that's fine because you don't care about it. But for you to exactly, think that this is So proof, you use me as an example for your indemnity. Is what you're saying? Is it, Felix, is, I don't, do you think that, this clip is compelling? Do you see what I'm saying that this example is really dishonest? <laughs> Okay, so in that clip, my uh, my editor edited you your own words saying it. Oh, can I ask you him. something? Your editor did this. Have you watched it? Um. Well, yeah, I watched it. Like you just did. Oh, yeah. you did. Oh, you just so, watched it for the first time. So, so the cuts. Are Have you watched the unedited version on my podcast? Um. Yeah. It's, it's okay. The, so the then, why are, was this removed? If you don't let me talk, I mean, we, we're not gonna have a conversation. Well, you I just want to get, I just want to get to the point. You know what I mean? Because I don't want then, you to deflect. Then, I want to know then, why you cut then, this part. Then, when you ask a question, you have to wait for me to answer. Otherwise, it's not gonna work. You said, okay, go ahead, please. Because you I asked a question, you did three times. That's okay. Go ahead. Um, okay, so there's four, there's four of them out of many of them, by the way. There's, there's we only uploaded four because we didn't want you to go crazy with the DMCA stuff. Um, basically, it's pretty much a lot of it is spliced and it's back to back. So yeah, yeah, there is a cut, but it, yeah, so. it's, it's like it's like you're pausing a video, but it's the same thing. You go in stretch of the two and a half, three you minutes. You haven't I'm proven talking. that. But here's what I, here's what I will say. Well, well go go to get one other one. <laughs> go get the one from uh, um Meat Canyon. That one is you. Okay, okay. okay. Would, yeah, go ahead. You com you combo um mustache twiddling, hair and neck skin, and you do like this. Yeah, and here's you have my, also such thing, and that's that's major, that's major react, bro. I, yeah. I, I have to give it so, to you. Right. That's no, you're right. Of, you're right. That's me, you understand this concept because you talk about it all the time. Me Canyon is my friend who gave me permission to react. Oh, oh, so it's about permission then. So now Sometimes. we're going to go post. Well, hold on. Room? It is. Hold on. I, before we move on, I just want to make it clear that when you're accusing me of not adding enough commentary, that you did upload a clip that's deceptively edited. And I mean, frankly, dishonest. Why did you cut this beginning part? Okay, so Ethan, Ethan. Why did you cut this? Unfortunately, the, the problem that I have right now is that you're saying that now, and you're saying all this, this whatever, right? 
but it's quite literally you in the video that's that's edited that says if you're sitting there cuts in it it does it's not the video how how is if there's cuts in it how it is how is that a representation of my analysis all right then uh, examine exhibit b the meat channel one i already told you i had permission okay okay so why do i need to look at that so now it's about permission that is one aspect yeah in the video you're trashing me, you say he's sitting there for 40 seconds without talking. Mm-hmm. That's, one of, that's one of your major concerns or criticism. It's why it's highlighted so much in the video. But that's the, that's a, a big hit you can do at me. And I'm going to show examples of you yeah. multiple times where you go, not only 40 seconds, you go two minutes <laughs> so here's, without talking. So, so then, so then right. I don't have to argue against you. You have to argue against yourself because these are your own words. Well, you can watch your own video. So here's what no. I'll say about that. No. I, no. I, you're right. Because the 40 second thing is not a good analysis. That's not a good, that wasn't a good thing I said. Because when you're considering fair use, you, you take it consider back, it in the totality of it. Take it back. Yeah. No, you're, you still are a content thief, in my opinion. Take it back. Yeah. No, you, why would I take it back? Because if you're going to reel it back and say, oh, I, no, I, I just said that wasn't wrong. a good analytical point. I still think you're a content thief. Okay, but so take back what you said then. Why? I believe it. I, I know I am. No, I apologize no, no. for the 40 second thing. I don't think it was a good analysis. Okay. You want to go with the other comments that you made or not? Huh? You want to go with the other comments that you made or not? Which comments? We, we could go through all of them. Because you're wrong. You're wrong across the board. So, every behavior every behavior you call me out on, you have done in those videos. Okay. There's if four, you say so. But why what is, if do you no, want to don't Okay, hold on. Let me ask you a question. What is it, 12, why does that matter? Why does that matter? Okay, because um earlier uh, you said it. You care about this all the time, not all the time. And I give you an answer. You were like, got him. He said, he said, not all the time. When you seem to be the guy who doesn't do any stealing or thieving. And I have four examples right there. And you're, no, you're, you did not show an example. Well, but then, then get, get another one then. Well, that's not my job. You're the one that's trying to prove it. Why the fuck should I go pursue and try to prove I don't do fair use? That seems stupid. Wait, that seems like that's exactly is that what you guys have been doing on Twitter and whatnot, right? That's your whole concern. Yeah, I'm showing are... stuff about you and not telling you to go find a video of yourself not okay. doing fair use. That's moronic. So you said thief, right? Yeah. Show me one. I just did with the Anne Frank one. You did 44 seconds of commentary on an 8 minute, 30 second video okay, where you but... offered no critical analysis. And do you know if I had permission? Did you have permission for that? Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe I didn't. Did, so did, why don't did, you did... tell, wait, why won't you tell me? Did you or didn't uh, you? Oh, I'm, I'm just saying, are we moving the goal? Are we moving the goalpost there now? It's not a goalpost. It's just another facet of the conversation. It's not a goalpost. It, it quite literally is when you make it a goalpost. Okay, w- I do want to talk about the permission thing. Okay, there you but go. I just want to. So I, I do want to say one thing. In my career, in my ten years of career, I'm sure that there's been times where I have n- I've done a less good job of reacting fairly to content. I'm sure of it, right? And so that's you are a thief then. So you are a thief some, and you're not anymore. And that's something I acknowledge and something that I'm always working on and analyzing and thinking how I can do it better. It's something I, I really care about. And the reason why this conversation is interesting is because it's something that you don't care about. And I'd like to know, I'd, I'd like to understand that. But are you saying, have I ever done a bad reaction in my whole career? Yeah, pro- yes, probably, okay. almost certainly. So, so then, would you agree that e- old Ethan, or not too old Ethan, is a thief, sack of dog shit motherfucker? Uh, sure, yeah. In those, if, if that's what happened in that time, sure. I was a dog shit sack, loot, whatever the fuck you said. Have you made any efforts to repair yes. the damage or the things that you've stolen from the people that you thieved from? Well... Again, I don't have specific examples. There's nobody that's approached me, so I, it's, you and know. And have you taken accountability the same way you want me to take accountability publicly for that? I just did, didn't I? Not, not really. Why not? I just said, yeah, I've probably done that. What do you want so me to you're do? Gonna, you're going to rob a bunch of people and say, guys, I might have robbed somebody. Lol. I'm moving on. I mean... Well, it seems like kind of, a, kind of a cop out, to be honest. Well, it's not like going in a store and sticking somebody up. Fair use is so, interpreted by judge or jury. So is it is it is it thief or is it not thief? Because the way I see the it, the way you do when, it, I when think you is that steal theft. something from somebody, right? There's gonna be a process of like finding who's guilty, how much, and there's a whole process behind it, like the legal system is. Just like I mean, don't you care about the legal system? You seem to care about DMC a lot, right? So being a thief, surely you're gonna care about that a lot. So did you damage them? Did you talk to them? Did you make an apology? I don't know which where Seems who the like victims are kinda... or if there are any. All right, let's move oh, on. We're oh, talking oh. in circles a little bit. We want to oh, talk oh. about the permission thing. 
So, I mean, so what you're doing is running away pretty much. You're not, we're not running. Well, no, we're I, not running in direction and you're going straight forward. That's what's going on right. now. That's clearly not the case, but gotcha. it's, I'll, I'll, I will on, just let it be for the sake of continuing the uh, argument. Gotcha. Keep going. But man. yeah, you do it every single day. I mean, I've done it maybe a few times in my career. I've done, you know, uh, and again, I don't know who the victims are and if they come or, or nobody's ever come to me. Has anyone ever complained that you stole their videos? Um, anybody that has anybody ever? Me? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, 100%. Okay, because yes. nobody's ever complained to me about that. Oh, so now you care about robbing somebody, right? Well, the, and if they didn't tell me, well, you know what? We're you're saying it, the victim exactly, of the crime doesn't matter, which is exactly what you went after me with. Does, the, does with the victim else, of a crime it, not matter? Well, he's asked, he's asking after the fact that was the exact argument that you went at what? me for, and you're running away from it. I don't know. Listen, the proof that you have victims is literally just concrete proof you did it. That's the only reason I'm saying it. I don't understand oh. your point. So when we say victims, I said yeah, people you, that... some people you stole from. They're a victim. Okay. So okay, what about your victims? I don't know who they are. How many times do I need to say that? Okay, okay. me reaching out and making an agreement with them and creating every time. This... Yes, we we I, I you're not okay. Listen, Ethan. If you want to, if you want to open up the chat and go with the logs, I have so many logs to make your head spin. Let me ask okay? you a question. Do I have you... over, I have hundreds of emails sent. People more than any reactor, which is more than your friend Hassan. He does way less asking than I do. Why are you bringing up Hassan? What does that have to do with anything? Because whenever he was on your podcast, he was sucking his balls out. Well, right? that's when so he again, does this is, uh, Mr. Dude, Chair react and uh, with all dude, you're respect. so dishonest. You don't, you don't even know what you're talking about. Last week, I chewed him out for an hour to the point where I had to apologize because people were mad at me. That sounds like your problem. You literally no, don't know. That sounds like your problem. It is my problem, but you're not, you have no consistency what you're talking about. You just said I lick his balls, and now my, I proved my you wrong. Consistency? You, 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 you make no sense, bro. So what do you I'm mean a it's my problem? Piece of shit for doing chair react when he does. All right, this, this is so mindlessly dumb. Let's just move on to the perf to per, the permission part. You know, you know, I don't, you want to fucking keep doing a sprint? Let's just keep running. This is a marathon, me and you. How about that? Because we're running a straight line right now. I'm I'm running after you, and you are going straight forward. Okay, good. I mean, that's the point so, of the conversation, right? Let's so just keep going. Then. How? What percentage of people would you say you get permission from? Um, the majority. Because yeah. the way it works for me, but for React, the main lines, most of the content that I like, I have it all lined up, right? So people that I really like, I like the best. Um, we uh, we reach out to them and we create this little um, kind of partnership, right? And when there's a smaller creators, I try to be way more careful with um, the amount of growth that they're getting, um, how, how many subscribers that they have. And I try to, I try to be um, better with it. And quite honestly, when it comes to small creators, I've never had any pushback, right? So no victims in that case. Okay, that's that's perfect. Have you heard of a guy named Vince, Vince Vintage? You reacted to two of his videos. This one was a, from a month Flying ago. A stolen airplane. You remember this video? Um, Disappearance of FBI's most wanted 16 year old XQC reacts. This is from a month that, ago. That was two and a half months, uh, two, and no. two and a half weeks ago. Okay, perfect. So it was very recent. So, yeah. so would you consider this guy a small creator? He doesn't have a lot of subs. Uh, in fact, here's his original video. Flying in a store. It ha he only has 400,000. Well, that's not small. But anyway, you did this recently. Do you know who that guy is? Uh, yes. Okay. Why didn't you ask him for permission? Um, I don't know. Did, did he did he did he complain? Because at at this point, I don't know if I have a victim, right? I don't know. So I didn't do. Well, you do I, actually. And what's funny is I literally just reached out to one random person from your recent reacts, just one who followed me, because I oh, knew. Oh, yeah, it's just one. It's just one. It was only one for sure. Yeah. No, I swear to God. I so just you wouldn't ask? Are you a victim, by the way? Are let me hold on. This is important. This is this is important for you to understand. So I reached out to Vince Vintage, and I said, right. hey, I'm just curious, did XUC get permission? And I'm going to read you the message he sent me, if that's okay. Go ahead. He said, really appreciate you reaching out, Ethan. I've never been contacted by XQC at all for any of my Iraq videos. My personal take is this. I love big streamers watching, like XQC, Hassan, Mizkif, Moist Critical, watching my videos on their stream. It's a big ego bo boost, but when XQC does it, it's different. When he watches my video, he always re-uploads the whole thing on his YouTube channel with his insightful commentary as, wow, chat, isn't this crazy? Compared to when Hassan watched my stuff, he shouted me out and he says he loves my stuff and he sent a bunch of subscribers to my channel. A fair exchange. Here's a video. He showed me a video of, of Hassan doing that. And then he said, XQC, he really just steals my shit. 
entertains his audience off hundreds of hours I put into my videos while I get just a link in the YouTube description. The problem isn't the reacting, it's the re-uploading of my video with his face on the thumbnail and also, and, and I don't DMCA him because I don't want the, tri the Twitter drama. Oh, he doesn't want the Twitter drama. Wait, why okay. are you? Well, hold on. This guy says you stole a shit. Why are you denigrating that? I think you should take this seriously. Well, because one, he's a paid actor, right? Which huh? is, I think. Well, I mean, it, this is exactly. I mean, that's a paid actor, one hundred percent. Wait, what? What um, did you say? It's, oh, it's a paid actor. He's he's a paid actor. Yeah, it is what it is. Okay, I well, mean, just assume for the sake of the conversation that he's not a paid actor. Okay, for the sake of, yeah, okay. So the first guy you react, right? The first guy you send a message to sends you a paragraph that looks like the Bible, right? And it's stroking your ego out. Well, you know what? That's okay. I'll bite. I'll bite in a bum. Yeah, just, um, yeah. So what's, what's really cool about this, right, is that we can make that type of, type of interaction to have with this person and make it 10 times better um, for our um, ecosystem, right, of uh, how what I watch, what I upload. If he had asked, what, he doesn't have to, he can use the DMCA system. And maybe there will be Twitter drama or not. We usually we never make we never make drama for DMCA stuff. But then I don't know he, what you're talking about, dude. Why are you not me, responding me, to his accusation? Me, he says you're let, stealing his shit. Let me let, let me elaborate. Let me elaborate. I don't know. Okay. Let me elaborate then. He he would he would be a data outlier of a person who doesn't like it. And we can either recurve that, make it better, and I will de-damage him for every dollar that he had lost to me. Right, if he had analytics to back up how much the video uh, uh, on YouTube um, cannibalized his, or if any sort of um, damaging data or stats behind it, I would be more than hell. I would be more than happy to give him ten times ten x whatever damage okay, was good. caused. Okay, He'll reach out. Uh, have you ever paid anybody ten x before? Has that ever we, happened? We 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 have been how many times? Before. Whenever it arises, if they, if, it, if how many times that, does it happen? Oh, I will have to check with editor, but it, right, it, not it, a lot. It, I'd assume not a lot of people do that. Oh, okay. So the amount really um, is what you're looking at then. That, no, this, just the amount of times that people actually take you up on that. Because what you're saying is, I'm going to steal your stuff, and I don't care if you have a problem with it. You can come talk to me. Like that's not that's not your right. Shouldn't you apologize to Vince? Oh uh, yes, I, I apologize. It's not to Vince. it's not his job to come ask you for for reparations for you stealing from him. Don't you understand that? So what you're saying is that you went digging for victims that- I literally didn't... messaged one dude. Okay, so nobody in your production room believes Why that. don't you just apologize to Vince Vintage? Uh, I absolutely will, and I feel- I, I didn't get a Twitter DM. I didn't get, no, I didn't get nothing. I feel really bad. You want to know why? Because all about the, all, the whole sphere of this, everything around it, is to make something good happen. Right, and that matters That's to me such a lot. That's bullshit, bro. Nice try. You literally do it to enrich yourself. You're a multimillionaire, and you steal content from small creators, and you don't give a fuck about their rights or what they want. And then your only justification is, oh yeah, you can come chase me down and complain and try to get my attention so I can pay you for the shit I stole. It's total bullshit, bro. You're not creating right. anything big for anyone. You're just taking attention and views for yourself, and you don't give a fuck about the. The, uh, the consequences of that. It's not your decision to make that for other people's property. You, you sound like, um, watch out, you sound, kind of sound like Robin Hood or something. Are you like some sort of hero or something like that? Because it seems like you do a lot of that and you take the high road defense. on it. You take the high road on that. One, that's, that's my point. You have done that. You do that. You haven't and proven are, that. Well, it's, it's, it's all Okay, that, oh, fine, I did it. You know what I mean? It's like so stupid. Should, what is it? Should it what does because the, you can't use me as an example why? for your own thing. Because you keep saying that. You're doing it. Not proven. You're, do you're doing it. You call, me a, you call me a thief piece of shit when yeah. you're doing it. You haven't proven that. I don't know why you keep saying that. Oh, oh let, let me send one DM. I, I will, guys, I'm going to send one message and I, he will uh, automatically give me a uh, full response right now. Give me a minute for it. Okay. You're making fun of this message I got from Vince because Vintage, which is a genuine, he was expressing himself genuinely, and he was disturbed by the way he uses content. Can I ask you another question to, related to Vince? I'll take it down right now. I'll I will take it down. If Vince, if Vince wants to come in right now, I'll take it down right now. I will give you every penny yeah. of that, and I'll say, this ecosystem right, but that's doesn't just, work okay. for you. Let me, ask, let me ask you a question. This is Go the ahead. video, and you do this all the time. You'll agree. Yes. Yes. You, st you use the exact title and the exact thumbnail. The only reason for anybody to do that 
is to confuse search and discovery and cannibalize views from the original. That is the only reason to do that. Do you have any sense to back that up? Because I had the sense of the opposite. Dude, it's the, the thumbnail and the title. Don't you see that users will be confused? Let me tell you something, Ethan. Don't you think so? My YouTube channel does not grow. It quietly doesn't. But you're well, that's because you uh, just post a ton of shit there. No, you don't put any effort into it. Okay. And why do you think that is? Because you don't give a fuck. Okay. Clearly. So, gotcha. So, these are cut downs for the people that we call the YouTube frogs that are just watching my shit. Um, it's not your they, content, they though. You don't get that right. Okay. Well, same goes applies to you then. No, you haven't proven that. You keep saying that, but it doesn't mean anything. Okay. Then show me proof you asked for permission and you got it. Sh uh, why? Now you're asking me to show you proof? Dude, you're absurd. Why is it. Wait. It, you, you, you think it's crazy? Dude, the fact that you're using the same title and the same thumbnail. It's so parasitic. It's so shady. You, you are only doing that to siphon off views and confuse people. There is no other reason for that. Why would you use the same exact title and the same exact thumbnail? Explain that to me. So are you more upset about the title or about the content of the video itself? Well, it's the intention, dude. It's all, it's all together. You're, you're intentionally in, confusing in, people to click your video since, instead of his. Since you're, since you're all about legality, you would understand that intention is one of the hardest things to prove out there, right? I'm talking about philosophy. We already moved past legality. You don't care about fair use. Yeah, no, no. We, we, we can kind of like do... Just answer the how, question, Felix. How do you, how do you Why know, did you do that? Why did you give it the same exact title and thumbnail? Just answer that. Oh, well, because I wanted to. Why did you want to? Oh, because I wanted to. Why did you want to? Because the, the thumbnail is good, and it gives the viewer uh, what they want. Right. And, uh, Which is the original video. They want the original video. Okay, so the, okay, so I'll, I'll tell you, since, since you, you don't like questions, I'm just going to give you a fact then, right? Um, people that don't watch React content do not get served React content. If somebody wants to watch us react it. Oh, well, I thought it being cannibalistic was the problem with you. Well, is it not? <laughs> You're gonna try to say that the Google algorithm is somehow running D for you? That's crazy. It's stupid. So, so you so you said that it's cannibalistic. I give you a hint on why it's not. Well, it's, it's, the it's, it's the intention. Okay, so now, now it's the, so if you want to just keep going back and forth and say not there, not there, not there. Okay, so you see no You're problem with this. No. No. Okay. And if you added 20 seconds of commentary to his video and you use the same title and the same thumbnail, you don't see any problem with that. Uh, no. Okay. There it is. So, so it seems like you really need to doing. say. So it seems that you don't care about, it seems you don't not, not just care about the law. It seems like you don't care about, uh, people's artistic, creative, uh, property at all. It seems that you don't have any respect for property at all. IP at least. It seems like, um, nobody to my knowledge has a problem with any of my videos being up right now. But you're like a prolific thief. You could say, oh, I found one example of you doing this back in two, whatever year. You're a prolific thief, dude. You do this every day, multiple times a day on your YouTube channel. Gotcha. So I, I, I will go to somebody's house and say, uh, um, take something, and he doesn't care, right? He generally doesn't, and never, never <laughs> reached out. And you go out there, and you go and seek the victims out, right? And you failed to, um, to establish a pattern of them being cannibalized the way that they Well, there's just are. one. I mean, one is enough, isn't it? Okay. In that case, it puts the burden of proof on you as well, then. What? So you have permission. Yes, because I, I think... Uh, I don't what? need permission to, re to transform content, dude. Okay. So, um, one of the videos that, that, that I have... But I did, there's four of them, so you guys see all of them. Um, if, you have, if you have proof, you, should, you ask permission to any of those, you win by a landslide. Why would I need proof to transform a video? Oh, I mean, the only okay. one is me, Cannon, because he's my buddy. There's obviously ones where, like, it's obvious when you're buddies. I actually did ask me, Canyon. Oh, uh, it's, it's obvious. So I, I well, you to understand that. that on Twitch, you... too. There's people that everyone's friends with and, like, but, but, but this guy, you, I mean, Vince. So, yeah. okay, then. So you're making assumptions about me, but we're not making assumptions about not you. Not an assumption. I have a literal fucking message from the guy you stole from. It's not an assumption. It's literally a fact. Okay, so the whole reason why this debate was in the first place is that people were finding victims that didn't exist. They're so saying, oh, this I is did. a problem for people. Okay, okay. So you found a person who doesn't like it. Yes. And there's multiple um, ways out. For actually, he even everybody. specifically named you as the problem. He said the other people actually 
clouded me up where XQC completely stole my shit, added no valuable commentary, and then t stole my views. That's specifically what he said, actually. Okay. So, <clears throat> but that's a problem. And instead of reaching out in any way, shape, or form, um, he, he waited for you to the savior of the earth to come in and just Robin Hood it and just be a guy's I got, I got your bro. Why? Well, uh, how, do, oh, do, do you really not understand the concept that small creators wouldn't want to start shit with with XQC, one of the biggest, uh, with the craziest fan base in the world? Like, is that really a foreign idea to you that they wouldn't want to deal with this p power dynamic? Like, you would crush them if you said anything. Their, your fans would harass them into oblivion. That's too right. foreign for you to, to understand? So, so th this guy, um, foreign case subscribers, uh, big easy two videos small creators that's about to fucking die from something ethan is here for to save the day this person will now be able to afford some food what and eat some rice matter? tonight well i'm just saying because if you try to make a portrait if you draw a picture on who this person is and you say small creator like struggling and whatnot instead of he i'm saving him and you're just so he, right. you are misrepresenting so he doesn't matter oh yeah yeah, yeah he does matter but okay. not in the capacity not in the capacity that you're trying to paint which is what? I don't understand what you're saying. A small struggling creator. Somebody please help this person before I mean, yes. he goes out of business. That, well, no, I didn't say any of that. Well, uh, you did. You, uh, you, you, quite, you did. You just I did. actually quite literally did not say that. You said small creator. That's enough. Let, well, okay. I was up front about his sub count. I looked at it. Uh, but anyway, let's see. My, I mean, my, my bad. I was just wrong. I was just mega wrong. Uh, let's move on. Let's, let's you keep have running. been this entire time. It's fine. Um, right. So yeah, I'm sure you're you're familiar with this thread because he actually gave you permission to perform this analysis. Internet arc uh 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 arcanist arcan eh. archivist. He said Arkansas. I let X, he said I let XQ, XQC repost a reaction to see the impact it had. Okay, and the analysis is basically the video witnessed an 87 percent decrease in impressions on the day of the reupload. Okay. And the video also witnessed a 52% decrease in viewers on the day of the re-upload. Uh, and uh, let's, so, so, I mean, of the evidence that I've seen, then it, it actually shows that it has either a negligible or potentially even a negative effect on the original video. Gotcha. So, and actually, you... he even made you change the title and the thumbnail. So why do you think he asked you to do that, XQC? He said, don't use the same thumbnail and title. Why do you think he asked you that? Because as a uh, creator of the IP, like you like to fucking say. Would you because you siphon views from people, dude. It's so fucking obvious why you do it. You ask a question and you answer yeah, for me. You, you, want, you, can you can have a monologue if you want to. You just mute me and just go on a fucking rant. But if you want to ask me a question, you have to answer to listen to the answer. Um, here's the answer. He controls the IP. He wants to be different, right? And he wants some changes. And he... Um, he uh, spoke to us, right? So instead of cr instead of crying and being a little bitch, it seems like like Vince. Um, so it Vince seems... is crying and being a bitch. Bitch, is that what you're saying? That's, that's all I said. Wait, wait, what was my mouth? Are you? Well, I don't know who you're is, talking is, about. Is, is this is this Twitter or what? I don't no, know I don't mean. I just wondering who you're talking about. Go ahead. Okay. Um. So then, so then, um, like I said, I, I was saying, <clears throat> instead of being a little bitch ass, right? I think he understands at least that there's some positives to it if not a lot of positives, and some of them can actually do better. He right? didn't show any positive. Okay, if, if it was only negative, he would have asked us to take it down and would have done that, right? No, he it's, left it up for the experiment, and he said, do not use any of my other videos without my permission. He literally told you that. So, it's a social experiment at this point. It's like, a, it's like an, an experiment. So now, now it's the guise of experiment, and it's, he's only letting it because it's an experiment now. Okay, well, Thank I showed you. you proof it had a negative effect. Do you have proof it no, had a no, positive no, effect? No. No, you didn't. No, what? You, didn't. You, you absolutely did not. Absolutely not. So, show us that again. Sure. So, explain how this is good. He said, um, I'll let you describe the video witness an 87% decrease in impressions on the day of the reupload. So, hey, Ethan, that, Ethan, explain ha, that dub to me. Go ahead, Ethan. Um, do you, in your possession, have a time machine? Answer the question. You do not. Gotcha. Um, since we're going to do the whole, I, I'll answer for you. You do not have a time machine, right? Um, it is impossible to know how the video would have performed and how it went down in this its natural curve over time, right? Whether I watched it That's or an not. assumption. You have no proof. I oh, have proof. Oh, so you use... So I have analytics. Use, so one data set, right? You have no data set. 
At least I have oh. a data set. Oh my god! And I also, have... you're the dude stealing content, so the 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 onus should be on you to stop, prove stop, the great stop, benefit stop, stop, stop. of it. You you okay? I, I, I get what you're saying. Okay, I find it a little bit dishonorable and a little bit um, disappointing that in the middle of a, Sorry of a conversation about, you, about about analytics, you're uh, spewing words to your audience and mine about uh, me stealing and whatnot when we're trying to to prove that it quite literally doesn't help anybody. You're mudding the waters for no reason. Unpack that, please. Could you stop, please? Seriously, I mean it. It's gonna, it's gonna get really bad. I don't want to do like the whole insult uh, ad hominem thing because you're doing that. Okay. It's just a, okay. it's just a statement of fact. So, um, not an insult. Okay, I mean, okay. So as we go forward, you are fucking bald. You're very bald. You're balding. Your your hair is thinning, and it's gray, which is it means that you're old as fuck. Got it. Okay, shall we continue? Is this fun? The for, premise is, fun? is faulty, my is, friend. Is this fun? I have for a beautiful you? hairline. Baldy, baldy. Is this fun for you or not? I'm having trouble with the premise. It, it, it has a striking resemblance to you no. trying to argue your other points. It literally has no premise at all. It has you, no basis in you're reality. Just, you're just throwing insults for the sake of Go ahead. I'm going to be quiet. I'm going to sit away. I'm going to pack. I'll sit away. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So, I don't know if you've done any, any um, statistical analysis in the past. I don't know if you've I maybe had a stat class. Do you have any experience with statistics or not? Go ahead. Stats. Do you have any experience? It's a good, do you have any experience with statistics or not? Go ahead. Just, just make your point. What does it matter? Okay. Okay, the curve of a video and on how it performs, that looks like a natural curve, right? You can see it's already going down before I watch it, and it keeps going down at a certain rate um, past it, right? Do you have any proof or um, any indicators that the video would have performed poorly or better um, after the reaction? So obviously, that any data that we do have, which is of course just one, definitely proves that if it did have an effect, it's negative or negligible. And as the guy who is <laughs> try, I mean, right? I mean, you certainly can't say that this helped so, the video. So, are you so, actually arguing that a eighty-seven percent <laughs> decrease helped the video? XQC, that's really what you're arguing to me right now. That's yeah, awesome, so, dude. So, so we're gonna go ahead and have the conclusion that you did not have a statistics uh, uh, class at all. Oh, I understand yeah, your point, but like. Graham, but Graham. but it's so, it's not making any sense. And, the, and the, how is it that a fifty two percent decrease in viewers is a dub for you? Um, because it could have been a um, it could have been. it could have been a sixty five percent decrease, right? It could have been worse. Yeah, it could have been worse. But okay. Do you have any proof that it um that it would have been or would have been? Do you have any the, the data behind that or not? That's. I mean, dude, uh, that, that, that's such a silly way to try to deflect from this really compelling data. Because in my data sets, I have a lot of data sets, a, a bunch of them, and all the video curves have the same... It seems to me that you're looking for any excuse, any out to justify you stealing content from people, even and in the face it, of data that suggests that it's not okay. And here it comes. When the man fails to compile data properly, like somebody who knows what he's doing, you make a conclusion based on one piece of data that you don't even understand. Is this a, a way to proceed with for you or not? Is this a way to you to argue and have that conversation, or, or what, what's going on here? I don't get it. Well, me neither, dude. You're trying to tell me that of a, a significant decrease well, in views is a dub. Ethan, I'm gonna guess with you. I just lost 16 viewers since you've talked. Clearly, uh, you're robbing me. How do you know it, that it, if you're not boring? Maybe you're the fucking boring one. Oh, you're saying it's impossible to know. Because we we only have one. No, I know line, you're right? you're definitely more boring and not as fun to watch. Oh, that's okay. a well, fact. That, well, that really um, that's, that's a joke. Of course, though. I think you're very entertaining. You're very talented. Oh, thanks, man. Um, so I'll say this. Uh, ultimately, uh, I'm I'm pretty perplexed by this uh, this uh, conclusion that I guess negative data, even just one data set. Okay, I got you. Uh, you know what, dude? You want you want to go? I really didn't think you would bite on the data thing because you were gonna get fucking clapped, right? <laughs> but since you want the data, okay. I mean, even though you're the one that has to prove something that's negative, I can. I'll, I'll Before prove you, you do that, can you do me a favor? Read number three of his stipulation. What was, which oh, stipulation? Hold on, they'll, they'll, Dan will pull it up for you. This is one of his stipulations. Use a different thumbnail for excuse me, video. Put any direct competition in my video and minimize uh, audio. I'm sorry, I'll read it because with peace and love, I don't think many people understood that. Use a different uh, thumbnail. I mean, funny. just just being fair. Use a different thumbnail for XQC's reaction video to prevent any direct competition with my video and to minimize viewer confusion. Direct competition, viewer confusion. Even he thinks so. 
That's why you well, use the same title and thumbnail, bro. Why are you denying reality? Well, that Valor accent, I just lost fucking 16 views again. Holy fuck, it. it's kind of crazy. It better be funny um, or something, bro. Well, I'm, I'm just telling you. React harder, XQC. The one that says you, bro. That's it. Hey, listen, you're the guy who sits like this in fucking 20 degrees and does this. Oh, so, okay, so the, the transformative nature and, is, is about how, how straight you sit. Got it. Oh, Ethan. You want to talk about amount of transformation, then if we want to move on to that topic, let's just get some of your, uh, your I think your wife's old merch, right? Which is a oh, direct yes. I one love to this one. Topic. I, I saw that. Uh, I've seen it. I'm and some, sure of the arguments had, some of the arguments you had against it, oh my God. Mm -hmm. I think I changed the angle by 16 degrees and I changed a little bit of the gamma color on this one. That's very transformative. Okay, Ethan, I'm going to watch your entire thing, not react in any shape or form. I'm going to change the color of the gamma and opacity and I'm going to rotate it sideways. That's gonna be transformative, right? Ethan, come on. So let me ask you, let me, before I address that, and I'm happy to, I'm gonna address everything you said about Teddy Fresh. Go ahead. What does it matter if I'm a hypocrite? How does that affect this conversation we're having? Genuinely, because we're talking about the philosophical nature of taking people's videos, right? And I'm having this conversation with you, but instead of answering the question, you're constantly deflecting to prove that, no, I'm a bad guy, and I don't see how why you would do that other than the fact that you don't have a good argument to, to argue the substance. Like, why do you keep deflecting? What does it matter if I'm a hypocrite? Ethan, you know, sometimes you, you, send, a, you send like a tweet and people still, uh, people comment in the bottom and they say, there's still time to delete this. Um, listen, Ethan, there's still time to fucking end the call and you go about your day, okay? Before you say some really fucking dumb shit, okay? When you're out here saying, what is the matter that, Get I, to the that, fucking I, point, that I'm a hypocrite? I'm just saying, when you say, well, dude, um, what is the matter that I'm a, that I'm a hypocrite? Well, no, I'm just, genuinely curious, but I'll answer the Teddy Fresh it, before you do your monologue. It discredits all your points and makes you look no, like it doesn't. The, no, I'm you genuinely took the curious. High road, no, no, no. You took the high road no, I really want you to answer it. And you fell on your face flat. No, nope. it's time to let on the facts. No, it's an interesting Prove philosophical question. Prove, Prove me Why wrong. Okay, first of all, t the Teddy Fresh thing. So, Teddy uh, Fresh is a company with 30 employees. And by the way, I love whenever someone's losing a debate to me, they bring this up. It's literally the lowest hanging fruit. And if you know anything about me, you oh. know I've talked about this a thousand times. Yo. But I'll address it because you brought it up. Go we, ahead. We Ethan. have like a whole team of designers. And Don't sometimes care. our designers um, are, are taking stuff way too close to the source. And I agree. I and it's not OK. Give a fuck. So does my editors, which makes us about equal on that topic. So you can still sometimes when somebody gets confused no. at the company, you want to? when, when, you when one of the sweatshop guys gets, get, gets it wrong. Hold on. Oh, my bad. But when my editor gets it wrong. Oh, no, we, we are thieving. Hold on. Hold on. Let me finish my point. Yeah, no. bring out Hila. Hey, bring him in. Well, hold, I, on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Let me finish. I my didn't, point. Hold, I on, didn't, hold on. Hold okay. on. Your husband is bald. My husband looks awesome. Dude, my hairline is... You awesome. really... Okay, dude, the fact that you're coming for my hairline just proves how fucking delusional your whole... That's a metaphor for your all of your arguments. Okay, Teddy Fresh, we have designers, right? And it's a big... We have a fairly large company. This is a common problem in all streetwear. We've had designers who, who have pretty much close to stole designs. We fired people over it, and every time it comes up, we have company meetings and say, guys... This is unacceptable. If we've, you're caught doing this, mm -hmm. you will be fired. And it, we've made a strict guideline, and it doesn't happen anymore. What have it you hasn't done? happened. What have you done yeah. to prevent it? Okay. So, okay. this is really good. You, okay. You, you done? Okay. That's what you sounded like. Is he done, or...? No, he's done. Happening? You can talk. He's done. This is I'm like just being child, silly. Go ahead. I'm, I'm sorry. I don't know how you put up with this shit. I would fucking leave his ass. Uh, anyway. you're, bro, uh, I'm having a third child with him. <laughs> Oh, no, you're getting God. divorced. <laughs> Wait, XUC didn't even say we're getting divorced yet. Go ahead. <laughs> XUC is getting divorced. Um, you, know, you know, our four-year-old, though, would love your giraffe. I don't know who you got it for, but our four-year-old would love your giraffe in the back. Don't buy it. It's, it's, it's worth your price for no reason. It's a, uh, but I like it a lot. Okay. Yeah, it's really cute. Uh, okay, so let me, let me Ted, just... Uh, sorry, so, Ela came to defend Teddy Fresh because you're talking about I her business. I actually wasn't yeah. planning I'm, to come in, but yes. you brought up Teddy Fresh. Listen, then talk to me because uh, I'm um, the person running it? Teddy Fresh, yes. not him. Yes. Yes. You uh, want to talk about it, talk to me. I uh, understand, Hila. Okay. And the reason why I brought up that point, okay, is that sometimes some things happen where some, it's, somebody else's, it's somebody else's fault, it's a mistake, mm -hmm. it's a whatever, right? And some things just kind of happen, right? It's right. just kind of human, human nature. and just, totally. it's, of time that's, and that's that, bullshit and the question is what do you do about yeah, it yeah what are you doing about it on a daily basis <laughs> I, took, exactly. I took action about it yeah and it's not it hasn't happened 
Yeah. Since so things so, so came up so online, people pointed out to us. We had meeting, we had meetings at the office. We made oh. guidelines when we work with new graphics. What are you design. doing about it? That's the question. What are you doing? Okay. Okay. So if you guys stop bombarding and you actually listen to the this answer, this isn't bombarding. Bro, just I'm stop talking. with the fucking posturing. I'm defending my to, company. You don't, just answer the question. You don't need to do these. You, these like, if you'll stop interrupt, just answer the fucking question, bro. Nobody cares. All right. I. I, I okay. I'll answer the question. Okay. Um, so what you what you are agreeing with me is that sometimes, right? There's gonna be a mistake. There's gonna be a, there's gonna be something that somebody doesn't want. Daily and you'll basis with you. Go on, and, go on. And you will rectify it after the fact, in hindsight, correct? Yes. yes? What, what we did is not okay. You continue to do it on a daily basis several times. It would be different if I came here and I said I don't care. There's nothing wrong with it. I'm distributing to those guys who made the original graphic. I'm making okay. their life better while I'm sitting so, in a Gucci shirt, you know? Okay. Um, yeah, that was like a thousand bucks is what it is. I um, know. Exactly. Um, which I don't know why you would bring that up, to be honest. That's kind of... You want to talk about Wait, low-hanging fruit? I thought that it was a good point because you're taking... Because you're saying that you care. Hold on, hold on. Let's, not money. Let's not answer okay. the question. You do nothing to rectify it while we do. So go ahead. What are you doing about it on a daily basis? Every single person that has brought a negative point about the videos, but you don't change everything. what you do. We, we have. Well, 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 absolutely, we have. You literally said, "I don't care." Oh yeah, but I still do the right thing, though. Which is what? Right. The Wait, well, uh, which is work to make better thumbnails, better description, and to better work with the creators that are be behind the video, so that we don't fuck them over and they actually gain something from it. Now, I'd like to talk with Hila for a minute. So mm -hmm. what you're saying is that you're repairing from hindsight, which is something that, that even trying to get at, get at me at, right? And then you brought the fact that we have 30 employees to help us out. Okay, fair enough. Then I, XQC, or whatever the, the, the corporate company, a parent company is, right? Um, well, we only have like two employees, two editors, right? Mm -hmm. And hel help us out, guys. Like, this is so sad. We only have two guys. We're playing the victim card here, right? Um, well, they sometimes make mistakes too. Right. It and hasn't happened to us in a long, long it's, time it's, since we took well, action. This just happened to you on a daily basis. Just okay. I think the difference, if I can say, is that <clears throat> I've been listening. And when Ethan is asking you about this, for example, mm -hmm. you don't say that this is wrong. You, the you thumbnail, wanted, no, the missing, well, thumb, the matching thumbnail and title, you say, I did it because I like it. No, he says they're working on better thumbnails. So, so, it's so, a, so the answer has changed now. If this is your answer, that sounds a lot better. It, you know? it, it, the only reason why it's changed, okay? Is that I'm trying to make a bold point for him to latch off the fact that he's on the fucking high road. He tries to high road the whole process. Okay, that's your problem. When, when is that you, I'm right? When you are on the high road, it that's is a thin fuck. It is a thin fucking road when on the high road. Okay, because you have to be really tight with what you do, the things that you say, and how you act. Right? I think the, he's doing the, fine. He's the, live every day for hours. Please, so. please, please, please. I'm talking to Ethan or you. Uh, don't interrupt me. Okay. Um, so now you're taking the high road, okay? You have to be really tight in how you operate, right? So we say things like, oh, well, he does this and, and I never do this, right? Well, you are wrong. And I just told you. You haven't proven that. I, what? Okay, so the designs you stole. That's called, that's called being a thief. A thief, oh, yeah. piece of shit, garbage. Yes, that was fuck. not right when like, that happened. Okay. It hasn't happened so, in a long time and we made, and we actually made efforts to prevent it. You have not. You said your efforts to prevent no, it is do. better thumbnails and titles, bro. This is your example of better thumbnails and titles. Because this was two weeks ago. Same name, that. same fucking thumbnail. You, the guy you did the experiment says, change my thumbnail, change the name so that my audience doesn't get confused and so that you don't steal my views. Why are you denying that? It's so obvious. Okay. So, like I said, like I said, um, we answer the question. We, what's the question? That was the a question is, how is it that you can deny that you're stealing views and intentionally misleading audience to clicking your fucking video? It, intentionally? I, that is not intentional. How is... Oh, my God. Is it uh, possible? Now, is it possible? Now, let me, now, now, go ahead. Let's say someone comes from your stream. They've watched you all day. They love you. They're a big fan. They watched you react to, let's say, Mr. Beast's new video. Okay. Yeah. And then they come to the homepage, and guess what they see there? Mr. Beast new video. Do you think that they're, there's are they less likely or more likely to click his video after they saw it on your channel? Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna answer the question, dude. Well, more or less likely. Okay. Okay. No, okay. no, 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 no. And just answer one or the other. Two choices. 
less. Got him. Yeah. Did. Damn. So, so then you're Mr. Fucking, Beast is, that proves that you're stealing people's views intentionally. Okay, Thank right, you, bro. So, so, so the views and, and, and the click rate in that particular instance, do you think that would, that will end up being a raw loss of the creator or not? Sorry. Are we done um, talking about yeah, Teddy Fresh? I, yeah, if we're done talking about Teddy okay. Fresh, it'd be better because I don't yeah, want to get, feel like get, we're getting up. Uh, get out, thief! Before I fucking Robin Hood this shit. Before I start spreading the wealth of your company to other people. Holy shit! I'm about to come at you guys for things and designs. Jesus Christ, bro! You're being pretty silly, but ours is defensible. Yours is not. Or at least we've made. It's not defensible, but anyway, thank. You know what? I mean, I don't see oh, this conversation uh, going much. Guys, guys, it is defensible thievery, guys. They. No, you know, I, it, I, 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 it's I, stealing in the right yeah, way. No, I, 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 I retracted that as soon as I said it. Right, what you heard, I said we we've we've corrected the error, uh, an understandable yeah. error, uh, in my opinion, one that you refuse to remedy after time and time and time again. You provide me zero direct answers, and okay. um, and and cool. frankly, I think you know you're wrong, and I think you don't care that you're wrong because it benefits you greatly. You make a yes. lot of money. You don't want to change what you do. And here's another thing. You're not going to be able yes. to make uh, 12 hours of content for Kick, who paid you $100 million, if you can't steal other people's content. Because if you don't, what the fuck are you going to do? Oh, they sit there and gamble? Nobody's going to watch that shit. Nobody's going to watch this shit already. They don't care about you even having arguments. It's clear you're not very good at that. You lost 12 viewers, man. My views are very good right now, by the way. So I think we need like a therapist to, to give us a hint on where, when the tantrum ends. When does it end, Ethan? It seems like when you go on these tangents, you just you go on a rampage and you just ramble and ramble without making any concise point or a question. Is it you're done with that shit? Can we talk like adults now or not? Um, I think this conversation has kind of ex been exhausted. People would rather watch me full screen cam do the fucking warm. Do than that, watch your prime, bro. Than watch your do prime it for content. a week. Do a week of no reaction content and see how many fucking views you get. Oh, he's crying in the corner. He, oh, okay, sure. I mean, that's content, man. It's, ori it's that, original content, at least. Like yes, it? do that, bro. Like do it. That's like that, Jess. Dude, do I mean, you a week. You fucking love it, man. Bro, this is the most funny event yes, in the great. past fucking four years, bitch. It's, it's awesome. Do a week of no react content. Oh, man. Oh, even man, a day. Oh, even a day. Okay. Then. Do one okay, day then. without React content. I'm I'm serious. Hey, hey Ethan, Aiden, let's see um your wife's uh, merch sell um sales on the on the first wave when <laughs> knives and designs were stolen. Ninety percent. Let's do the figures. Let's Wait, see. hold on. You're just being you're just being silly, bro. Let me silly. Prove me wrong. Because clearly uh, the burden of proof is uh, is, is uh, on you now, right? Because if you make an argument, then you have to prove it. You go ahead and prove it. You haven't even shown. I mean, what? I Dude, you're, you're, you're being you silly, bro. You're being ridiculous. Well, it seems like uh, I have to prove everything, and you have to prove nothing. That's and you've not, not at all what's nothing. been happening. And you've done nothing except prove some defunct All right, thank you, buddy. It was a good chat. Actor. I think well, that I, we've I done a good done. job at getting no, to the heart the points, of what you, what you care about and well, uh, how points, you feel sir. about taking people's videos. I think it was illuminating. I think we had a really good conversation. Oh, my so, God, it's Jover. Yeah. I mean, oh, I, I don't think you have anything else interesting to say, so I think we can wrap really? it up. Oh, I think your audience thinks I have something interesting to say. It's just the problem is that you're running. How so long fast. do you want me to sit here and listen to you? See, watch you crawl around on the ground like a worm. I mean, I have a show to do, dude. Unlike you, I actually fucking organize and put work into my show. I understand for you, you're just burning time. You could sit here for 12 hours. That'd make your life easier. You wouldn't have to go steal videos. But me, I plan this. I have a show. I have a schedule. This is stop being interesting because you're just sitting there saying silly shit and doing the worm. <sighs> so with that being said. Thank Even you for calling. I feel it, like it was you. very illuminating, and I wish you the best, and I hope you have a great stream. Gotcha. Oh, one more question. I wanted to ask him, who is Mr. Chair? Mr. Chair is... Here, actually, I'll show this. Fuck. I wanted to ask him that. Sorry. No, it's okay. It's okay. It's, 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 it, that was not going anywhere. But here, for the people still watching... Here's him talking about so Mr. See, Chair. See, I have a concept in, in my chat um, called Mr. Chair. If I'm gone and I watch a video and I, I leave, uh, Mr. Chair watches the video for me. And chat fucking <laughs> loves Mr. Chair more than they like, they like me. Chat hates I think me. think that means that they like the original video. Which, the views of which you're stealing. But he's, he's saying, yeah, I just walk away in my chair. My chair does the work for me. They love Mr. Chair, okay? And for them, that has value. And I think that, that is, can be understated. That, the chair adds value. The chair. He said the chair, the empty chair adds value. How can I have a conversation with this guy? The truth is that 
He wants to be radically honest about what he's doing. He wants to say, I don't care about this. I'm doing it. I don't care. He wants to make a million. He wants to make a million uh, exceptions. Oh, if they come to me, I'll pay them. Putting the, the fucking onus on the victim to come to him, the biggest content creator in the world, where there's a huge power dynamic. The one guy I did talk to, Vince, says he doesn't want the heat. And of course, why would he, right? I mean, he's clearly not very stable to begin with. I mean, he hasn't slept in a fucking day. And so, uh, you I'm know, gonna... sending him a complaint could easily backfire on somebody. And um, he wants to be radically honest about it. But when, he, when it comes time to explain what he's doing is wrong, he won't own it. He's radically honest up to a point where you say, why are you naming it the same title and the same thumbnail as their video? Because I wanted to. He, he can't, he can't go there because he knows he's wrong. That's just mean. Sorry, but it's true. <laughs> and I mean, the diver the reason I was asking about another point I didn't get to finish was, why does it matter if I'm a hypocrite? Why does that matter? We're having a conversation, a philosophical conversation about fair use, about using people's content. I am trying to stay on the topic and have a productive, useful, philosophical question. If he's like, you're a hypocrite, how does that, and by the way, I addressed everything he said, okay? I just wanted to have a, I just wanted to understand where he was coming from. If I'm a hypocrite, how does that enhance or change the debate we're having? He's literally, literally just deflecting. That's all he was doing the whole time. So, it was about as productive as I thought literally. it would be, but, uh, what do you guys think? It's funny. I mean, I had to hang up on him. This was not... Like I said, he's got a 12 hours to burn. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> I, I don't know. We bought... We brought, like, a victim, like, an, a good example of him stealing it from a comic Paid actor, creator. bitch. Yeah. Paid Dude, he actor. said paid actor. <laughs> yeah. That's the funniest. Uh, I mean, so he's his, memeing. Like, <laughs> it's... <laughs> his I first mean, response is, it's a paid actor. That's awesome. And then his second response is, oh, well, he doesn't matter. He's just one person. Yeah. He's so content-brained. And then he goes, well, where's all your victims? And I says... I don't know. It's right. possible I've done it, yeah. But, like, well, people he don't complain to, the... to me every week. Right, yeah. I mean... People don't come to me every week and say, please stop doing this. Or Twitter drama, or people constantly telling him, hey, this isn't cool. And he doesn't, 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 does it. He also, like, laid out exactly what he could do to remedy the situation. And then, like, clearly didn't mean any of it. But, like, he <laughs> said, I'm gonna make an effort to, like, make my thumbnails different, blah, blah, blah. And then, like, the argument yeah. flipped on its head because he wouldn't ground himself in any Actually, arguments. he didn't say that. He says improve his thumbnails. Oh, improve. Which yes. is from two weeks ago, literally carbon copy. Yeah, they're all... With the only... There's only one explanation for that. Literally. To siphon views. Period, dude. Yeah. Period. All he I, has to do is tell his editors to make it look different. Like, that's all but, he has to do. But they don't want to. Right. Because they're lazy. And they right. don't want to change. And it's easy. And he likes things that are easy. And he won't admit that. He's against putting work into things. Dude, fucking paid actor. That's crazy. How much did you pay that guy? You know who? Uh, <laughs> Out of curiosity. I, dude, I swear to God. I, the big bucks? There was a, I, I had a list of a few people that I sourced from his recent reactions. And of the list, there was one person that followed me. This guy, Vince. By the way, I did want to say about Vince that he is a super talented, Vince Vintage is a super talented creator that you all should please uh, go check out and subscribe Let's to. Let's watch one of his videos. <laughs> He's um, Here, I'll pull it up, but his videos are really great. And I mean, it's straight from his mouth, you know what I mean? I don't know what, I don't know what else to say about it. This is a video he reacted to, and then this is another video he reacted to, both with the identical thumbnail and the identical title. And it's okay, like, I know he's a piece of shit. He doesn't care, and that's fine. But he can't admit it. To, only to a point, right? And then it's, you're a hypocrite, so it doesn't matter. Nothing matters because you're a hypocrite. How does me being a hypocrite matter at all to this conversation? I don't understand. Really don't. That's wrong. I'll tell you who's the paid actor. Fucking XQC, who's coming here acting, pretending like to care about people at all, and he's getting paid a hundred million dollars from Kick. But that's it. Yep. I don't know what to say. Yeah, I got it. The dude sucks. He sucks. What more can you say, man? He doesn't care. 
I don't know. I thought it was pretty cool when he crawled like a worm. I hope he does more of that. That was good content. I that was he... actually the most. Inter- he probably gained 16 viewers when he did that. <laughs>